What is up guys? Quick little reminder here about happiness and contentment. So I am pretty good at getting out of my bad moods and putting myself into better moods or good moods and finding my happiness in the moment. But even though I'm pretty good at it, having done the work, I still slip back into rut sometimes. I still slip back into negative thinking. and I still slip back into discontentment uh, with how things are and usually it's because I'm focused on what I'm lacking, what I'm missing, what I haven't gotten yet in life. And I caught myself in my thoughts these last few days. And here's the thing, guys. Like, even though I know this stuff and I preach this stuff, even the best of us, like everybody, even all the self-development people out there, they go through this shit too. Because our, our mind is almost like shifting gears. And sometimes we'll shift back into those negative head spaces without even realizing it. And who knows what the cause is. It could be anything, a number of things. But the issue, I think, comes from not realizing our mind has shifted gears and not identifying it early enough to be like, whoa, why am I having these thoughts? Stop. Take a step back. Breathe. Let me focus on what I do have. What am I grateful for today? What am I content with today? And if there's stuff you're not content with in your life right now, then by all means, change it. Make a plan. Make a goal. Work at it. But don't be so hyper fixated on the future for your happiness and getting the things you lack to make you happy. Because if you're still happy, if you're unhappy now and you get those things, you'll probably still be unhappy because the mindset's honestly kind of a little bit of an addiction, guys. You can get addictive to negative thinking, addicted to wanting more. Most of society is always looking for the next level up. New car, better job, raise at the job, better apartment, wife, I don't know, second wife, side, girl I don't know I don't know what people do but people are always just trying to climb and keeping up with the Joneses and more possessions more belongings to try to fill this void of just trying to be happy and getting stuck in this comparison paradigm of comparing ourselves to other people but there's always going to be people who have something that you don't have and if it's if you want it really bad then go for it for sure but don't make your happiness dependent on it you know do the work today to be happy today all things considered in your life and when you get that thing you can appreciate it more and you will still be content. So don't put off your happiness for another day, guys. Find the things in your life that you're happy about, even if you don't feel happy. Like, it could be something simple. You're breathing, your lungs are functional, you're still on this planet, you still have another day to change your story, you can still do the things you wanna do, you can figure out what you wanna do. Uh, you're alive, you're watching this video, the possibilities are limitless. Anyways, quick one today, just a little reminder on my little hike around Ladybird Lake in Austin. Love you guys for checking in. I'll see you on the next one. Be happy, runs. Yeah, I'm about to fade away. Cause every time I wake up, I feel like it's Monday. Something's going wrong with all the chemicals up in my brain. All of a sudden, I don't look at anything the same way. Gotta build up of my thoughts sitting in an ashtray. I'm sorry that I'm so inconvenient, okay? Just let me be me and I'll stay out of your way.